Okay, the Raspberry Pi has now been out for about a week, the Model 4. Uh, I've got the 4 gigabyte of RAM model, and uh, a lot of people have got these for retro games um, and just running games in general. And uh, at the moment, it, you've probably found that you can't really play any games on it, apart from the basic ones that are built into Raspbian. Uh, so I've been looking around and I've seen what flash games are available because obviously now we've got faster RAM, we've got more RAM, we've got a faster processor, everything is looking a lot better on flash uh, and here is an example so you can see I've got Doom here uh, so let's start a level and you can see you can run around uh, and shoot and it runs at quite a decent pace There you go, I don't know where the bad guys are here. Oh, someone's shooting at me, are they? No. Uh, but, uh, but that's Doom. Uh, but there's more games I want to show you as well. Is there someone shooting at me? I can't really tell. Uh, so let's quit out of that. But what I'll do is, these are all Flash games, so you need to enable Flash at different times. Uh, so the other one I wanted to show you was uh, a brilliant emulator. And I wonder if there's more emulators like this uh, online. Uh, and this is basically uh, a ZX Spectrum emulator and all these games are clickable and you can play them. Uh, so I wanted to play, and I found that Wheelie on the Spectrum doesn't tend to work on lots of emulators. For some reason I just couldn't find a, a proper working version, but this version is working perfectly well. Uh, so on this you just need to press enter because they've obviously cracked the game somehow. Uh, and there's up and down like that uh, and then left and right so if you slow all the way, oh, wrong way, slow all the way down, you'll turn around, and there you go, and accelerate. Uh, and so what you can do is you need to judge the speed for all the jumps and also all the slopes. So let's go up here, and let's go a bit faster to try and make this jump. Ah, that's obviously not fast enough. Let's try that again. That's more like it. And then slow down for the slope. Oh, and then I think wheelie? No, I think you had to accelerate to go over that. But this was a game I used to play back in the day and I loved it. Um, it uh, because I was into bikes, uh, it was just a really exciting one. So if I... Oh, there you go. Yeah, wheelie over. Really clever gameplay for back in the day. Uh, so if I go back, you can see... Loads of highlights on there, uh, all sorts of games. I mean, it is it is amazing. The other one I liked uh, was Bomb Jack. Um, Manic Miners on there and Jet Set Willy, but they seem to jump all the time, and I don't know if it's something something to do with my setup. But let's uh, so K for keyboard, uh, press one for start, and then I can't remember what keys I was using. There's a left and right and a jump. There you go. Uh, and if you tap and hold jump, you hover, so you can get more of these berries. It's a bit like Pac-Man in the way that you're trying to catch all of the things. I remember playing this in the arcade. Get that power pellet. Very much like a version of Pac-Man. But really enjoyable, really playable, uh, and stands the test of time, I think. Maybe not graphically, but gameplay-wise. Uh, so, as I say, loads of games on there. I won't go through any more of those, because you get the gist of that, and you may have some favourites. Uh, or if you haven't played a Spectrum before, it's worth trying out some of the games. Uh, there's some really good ones on there. So, let's close down that tab. And uh, so, I've done Doom, I've done Spectrum. Uh, my Favourite, no I won't do my favourite, I'll keep my favourite to the end. Uh, this is very good though, a um, bit, of, bit of a theme with bikes which there always is on my channel. Uh, so if I press escape, up goes accelerate, down go, down brakes. So we've got to make this jump, nearly pretty, pretty good though. Uh, and this is user generated tracks, so it's quite nice to see. There you go, uh, and that's that's worth a try. I'll put a link in the description to all of these games uh, because they are very playable. And I've tried to pick ones where the advertising isn't too much, uh, or they're trying to get you to download things or or sign in or anything like that. You did have to sign in on Doom, uh, 
um, but uh, but none of the rest you have to. Uh, Internet Arcade didn't really work for me. Uh, it's, it's got some issue with the flash, but obviously that may change with time. Uh, so 90s games, there's loads of stuff in here. Now you must be able to find something you like from this. Uh, so let's close down, again, close down that other tab just so we're not using more resources than we need to. But the browser does seem to be working super fast now. Um, it, it really doesn't feel like the specs would suggest, uh, you know, if you pick a Windows computer with this sort of specs, it would be awful. Right, so... No, I'm terrible at this. And it... It runs really fast. I don't know if it's faster than it was, or the right speed. I'm doing better than I normally do. <laughs> Famous last words. So hit games, and that will take you back to the games list. Uh, so let's try another one, Sonic the Hedgehog. Uh, hit start. This is um, not the original Sonic the Hedgehog. It is a remade version, um, but it still plays really well. Oh, oh I didn't mean to do that. Uh, so when you click on, why is it doing that? I don't know why it's doing that. It wasn't doing that before. Maybe I just need to, maybe I scrolled down too far. So once Flash has been enabled for a website, it seems to stay on. Uh, obviously there's various different settings in the browser. Yeah, so I was going down, I didn't need to. Arrows and spacebar. So main game goes tails. Start game. You can see pretty fast, um, and the standard moves are there. I want to stop. So, oh, so very familiar. How did I, how did I manage to not do that? Oh, I was through already. And you can also hover, a bit like Bomb Jack. Or you can fly up as well, can you? Crikey. That changes the gameplay a bit, doesn't it? Anyway, that's Sonic. Uh, a few others from here. Obviously, there's loads for you to try. Oh, the Pac-Man one was really good. Um, obviously, you know, very low on resources. But this looks nice, this one. You can make this bigger by just going to the, the little three dots there and you can zoom in more if you want to. Uh, I'm happy with it as it is. So, what's going on? Oh, if this happens so you can't play it, just click anywhere on the screen and you'll find that you can. Oh, it's not looking good. Oh, not bad. So I guess you all know Pac-Man. Let's just go and get that. Oh, I was going to get the throat. Uh, let's go back to games. And as I say, I'm saving what I think is the best till last. Uh, Quake didn't work. I haven't tried that Doom. Oh, yes, I have. That didn't work either. Um, Donkey Kong was decent. Uh, I quite like the Prince of Persia on there. As you can see, there's a lot, there's a lot to choose from. Uh, certainly to tie the time until all the proper emulators get up and running. So with this uh, shift is to, to walk. So there are times when you need to be a bit more stealthy and a bit slow. So you can move and you need to stand in the right position. So you use that walk mode for that. Um, but also there's potions to, to get and you get swords. And then you have to use the swords against the enemies. Uh, so shift drinks that. There you go. Uh, right, I think that's probably all I was going to do from this. Oh, the Crash Bandicoot's not so great and doesn't run very well on this. Um, but you can see there, loads of games, and you can see with my mouse, I'm using a wired mouse and keyboard still on 2.4 amps. Uh, it, was, it went slow just now because I was charging my iPad from the same 
gang socket and I think it was taking too much power but I've unplugged the iPad and it's back to normal um, so I think that's fine now right was there anything else I wanted to try so Spectrum Doom 90s games canvas rider yeah so the last one the best one uh, and I really think this is great so if you ever get this symbol you just need to allow flash because Flash is known for slowing down browsers and slowing down systems and being very, very uh, resource hungry. But it copes really well. I guess the faster RAM and the, the more power and the fact that the operating system is super light. Right, so. Click on play demo. Uh, so we'll do obstacle course first. And we won't use that. We'll be a bit more politically correct. Right, so. Uh, up and down is accelerate and brake, and the space bar is a jump. I don't know how you're supposed to slow... Oh, oh that worked quite well. Oh, so close. If you don't get this right first time, it's quite hard, this bit. Right, let's go back off. Right. Let's get some speed. Forward. Oh, wrong button. <laughs> Come on. Oh, that's good of that. Oh, okay. Oh, I was up then. If I'd have pressed it. <laughs> right, okay. Uh, if you press escape, you can restart the level. Uh, let's try it again, because it seems to be, if you get past that bit, you're fine. And what do you do? Jump to crouch. Yeah, yeah. Or the, oh, yeah, that worked really well, yeah. What a, oh. Oh. So, can I move back to my... I'm still controlling my... He's not going to grab all of that, though, is he? <laughs> <laughs> this game is ridiculous, but it is really good. Right, let's try it one more time, uh, and then I'll show you another level I like on this. So, crouch. Yeah, that seems... Oh, yeah, that worked really well. Oh, come on. Why do I find it so hard to do this bit? That's it. That's it. There we go. Still looking... Oh, Am I still going? Can I still carry on without my head? No, I can't. Uh, right, so let's change level. Uh, and go with the BMX part, which is quite amusing. So a different vehicle. Obviously don't try this at home. Different, different physics altogether on this. Uh, it's much more sort of aggressive the way it leans forward and back, which obviously leads to the comedy value. Oh, oh. oh that's not going to work, is it? Where's my bike? So let's change. Uh, let's try one more level, which I haven't tried. Rope swings. Oh, what was I tried earlier on? I tried bomb. I think it was this one. This was pretty amusing. Yeah, so you've got these explosives and then you've got to jump. And there was a helicopter bit, which I couldn't really... I don't know what I was doing wrong. Yeah, there. Right, he's on there. How do I stay on that? I did before. This obviously going to not end well. Uh, right, okay, one more. One more game. Let's, I've done the BMX. I don't know what Snowy Mountain Final is. What's going on there? Oh, okay. <laughs> what am I supposed to do there? Let's try that again. Yeah. 
I don't quite know what's going on there. Anyway, uh, I hope this helps. I hope this gives you something to try on your Raspberry Pi other than web browsing and uh, office tasks and things like that. Obviously, there's loads more things people can do with Raspberry Pis if they know what they're doing. Uh, I don't really know what I'm doing an awful lot. Uh, and so I'm playing some games on it and just running through some general things. How do you do that? I still can't. I'm looking at it. I can't think how you do that. I'm sure there's, uh, obviously, once you see it, it will be obvious. Anyway, uh, thanks very much for watching. Please like and subscribe.